Hey guys. Today we gonna talk about end-to-end -end encryption. What is an end-to-end -end encryption? Well, first of all, what is an encryption? Encryption is the science of hiding message in such a way that only an intended user can read the message, not an attacker in the middle. Encryption is another topic, so I'll make a detailed video some other time. So, for now, only you have to know encryption is used to the hit a message. So, in an end-to-end -end encryption, the users send the message using a key called public key which should be same both side and users should exchange each other public key before transmitting a message. Now whenever you send a message, there can be three scenarios. First one is that when you send a message to your friend, it can be encrypted by you but your service provider can decrypt it and read it and then forward it or it can be read by hackers. The second one is that when you send a message to your friend, it can be encrypted but still, the service provider can know whom you are sending to. But they can't read the message. The third condition is that when you send a message, nor your service provider nor messaging company nor attackers ever know what you're sending. That's end-to-end -end encryption. Nowadays, every messaging app is using end-to-end -end encryption such as WhatsApp, Messenger etc. Pro and con of this encryption colon. First of all biggest pro is your data security. Nor your service providers nor attackers can see what you're sending and to whom you're. The con is it still can be attacked. How? Suppose Alice is sending her key to Bob and attacker steal the key then it can be a problem. The second con is it can be used by terrorists too. That's all for now. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoy it, give it thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Take care and goodbye.